Hi reception, so welcome to um, art lesson today. So last week we um, started looking at our topic of um, what we see in the summer and for art we produced a um, our own version of um, the famous painting of Sunflowers by Vincent van Gogh. So um, this week we've got a new famous um, painting to have a go at um, drawing and this painting is called Boats in the Harbour and it's by the artist Andre Duran um, and he was born in 1880 and died in 1954. So this is the painting that we're going to do. It's Boats in the Harbour. Um, so I've had a go at doing it. I'm just going to turn the iPad around this way so we can get it in for you. So I used the pencil to kind of sketch out all the main bits that I could see. So I've got some boats here along the shore, some people here. There's a boat out here, got the mountains in the back. So I used the pencil first. Um, I started at the back. I started with the mountains actually because I thought they were easiest and then added the bits in for the boat and then put the boat in. Um, and then came down and did the bit at the shoreline, um, the person who's this person here, and you can't see it very well because it's in pencil, but I've got the person who sat there too next to him. So um, I added those bits of two people there in the boat, got some more boats here, um, and then I started adding the bits into the sea, and then I started using crayons to build up the picture. So your... Um, what you're going to do is you're going to have a go at recreating um, your own version of this famous painting, Boats in the Harbour. Okay, now I've decided to use wax crayons. It's up to you what you decide to use. Um, maybe you can ask your adults, maybe if you can use some paint, or you can use wax crayons like me, or pencil crayons, felt tips. Um, maybe have a go at um, using a few um, different materials so maybe use wax crayons and felt tips and see what effect that gives you um, because obviously you can see on this painting there's these bits here um, which are are slabs of color so they're not completely colored in so it's putting them in I mean I started doing it with my wax crayon and just making lines but with other resources, you might get a, might get a different texture and a different. It might look slightly different. So it's always nice to maybe have a go with some different resources. So your go, you're going to recreate um, boats in the harbour. There's mine, the start of mine. Um, remember, get your adult to send a photo of your work into us so I can put it on your portfolio. Um, that all work that's sent in gets points. Um, dojo points, dojo points add up to remarkable um, points. Remember, remarkable points mean rewards. Um, I've also put a picture. I've taken a photo of um, the original boats in the harbour um, and, and put that with the video um, as a resource so you'll be able to see both of them. Okay, so you can keep on looking at that while you are making your own version of it. I look forward to seeing what you come up, come up with reception. 